Hello everyone, welcome to this video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can fix if your Discord microphone is not working on your mobile device. This can be your iPhone or your Android and in this video I'm going to give you guys some easy ways in order to fix that. So the first thing we need to make sure to do is that our microphone of our iPhone is actually working, of our Android of course as well. So you can do this by heading over into voice memos or any other app that basically uses your microphone. And you can just need to make sure that your microphone has actually been picked up. If it is not, then this literally just means that your microphone of your device is basically defect, meaning you need to repair it. However, if your microphone is being picked up, then it just means that it is an issue with Discord and that can definitely be fixed. So yeah, in order to fix this, what we first want to do is head over into the App Store, just like this. We're going to type in Discord, just like this. And we need to make sure to update it to the latest version because maybe there's just some bug currently going on with Discord and you can easily fix that by updating the app. Now, if you've already updated the app to the latest version, then the second thing we want to do is head over into settings and we're going to simply type in Discord in the search bar. This will work over on your iPhone and Android. Just type in Discord like this and click on it. And basically what we need to make sure to do is microphone is set to enabled. So make sure this check mark has been enabled or the switch has been enabled as you guys can see. And once it is, this means your microphone is enabled and that's really, really important. Now, if it's still not working after that, then the third thing we can do is actually up the, uh, basically clear the cache of our Discord app. So in order to do that, head over to Discord like this. Then what we need to do is go to the bottom left right here and then go to the top right here at that settings icon. And once you've done that, scroll all the way to the bottom till you find clear cache right here and just click on it a few times and it will say cleared cache. Make sure to do that and then just reopen the app and maybe that fixes any issue you are having with the Discord app. If it has still not fixed that issue, then what we can simply do again is head over to our profile picture settings. But now what we're going to do is scroll down to you find voice right here. And we need to make sure that input mode has been set to voice activity. So click on that. And you need to make sure that auto sensitivity is disabled and just put it basically almost at uh, almost disable it, but just basically put it somewhere right here. Just almost that it will most likely pick up your microphone. Once you've done that, scroll down and make sure that noise expression has been set to none and just disable auto cancellation, automatic gain control and also disable advanced voice activity. It will literally say right here, turning this off may help if your voice is not being detected by the automatic input sensitivity. So yeah, that's really important. Then reopen the app and maybe your microphone will now work. If it's still not working, what we can do is head over into settings again. And what we now need to do is hard reset the entire Discord app. In order to do that on iPhone, head over to general, iPhone storage, and then just scroll down until you find Discord right here. Then click on offload app and click on offload app, and then reinstall the app using this exact page. Basically, once you've done that, just open the app again and you have hard reset your app. And this will most of the time fixes a lot of issues you are having with the app. On Android, you can just search Discord again right here, and then you will find a clear cache button right here, and it will basically hard reset the app as well. And once you've done that, you can reopen the app and that should fix the issue for you. And yeah, that's basically the easiest ways in order to fix any issue you are having with the app. So let me know down in the comments which fix fix it for you. Or if you have any help needed, then just comment down below and I will definitely help you out. And that being said, then please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel. And I hope I will see you in my next YouTube tutorial video.